there may be times when you need to know the reflectance of different surfaces or different materials in a project. So you want to build a daylighting model and you need to be able to figure out the materials to use. You need to know the reflectances of the existing space first in order to be able to select the appropriate materials to make your model from. So in Baker we have three ways that you can do this. The first way is using a luminance meter. What you're going to do with a luminance meter is use this in conjunction with an 18% reflectance card, which will be in the back of one of the luminance meter cases. Now what this does is it will reflect exactly 18% of the light falling on it. The best way to do is turn this on. This is measuring in candelas per meter squared right now. Hold this up on the surface and you want to avoid casting shadows yourself as you do this. Hold this up about six inches away Click it, and it will give you a value. Write that down. Take this away, and at that same six inches away, click again, and get your value. Now, you know the amount that was reflected, or illuminated from the 18% surface, and then from your wall. Take the ratio one to the other, multiply by the 18%, and you'll have your answer. The other way to do it is using an illuminance meter, not a luminance meter. And this, what you are going to be best served doing is using one of the light cores with a small uh, photometric sensor. Turn it on and let it calibrate just like you normally would. Take the cap off. Now what you're going to do Stand back so that it's roughly six inches away from the surface, and it'll give you a measurement in lux of the light falling on the sensor. Record that. Now turn your sensor around, and whatever percentage of light that you got from here that you're getting here is your reflectance on the wall. With both of these, the walls in the Baker lab have been marked with the reflectance of the paint that was used. So when you're doing this, we recommend just doing a quick trial here in Baker to uh, get familiar with what this feels like and you can ask Baker staff any tips and techniques. The third way is to use the back of Mead. Uh, in one of the appendices, there's a list of reflectances of common building materials. And that's not going to be exactly specific to your space, but it's a pretty reasonable way to get an idea so that you can go on building your daylight.